All right, guys. Today I'm gonna to be opening up my Bam Geek Box. Um, but before I do that, I have an order from the Funko Shop um, that I got a, a few different Funko exclusives that were on sale. Uh, so I just want to open that up and see what's in there. Make sure all my pops are in good condition. All right. So it looks like they wrapped them. They put them in individual boxes, which is pretty pretty good. So. Hopefully everything is in pretty good shape. I got four of them. This one is... Let me make sure that the box looks pretty good. Looks pretty mint to me. This is... Sully with Boo. Funko exclusive. These are all exclusives that I got from the Funko website. They all came out within the last, like, couple of weeks. Oh, we got two in this one. Got. So this is my third exclusive from the Batman. This is the Funko exclusive with the wing suit. The other two I got were Pop in a Box exclusive where with Bruce Wayne without the mask on, and Target exclusive that was just Bruce Wayne in like his suit jacket. And the second one in this box is. Skiing Freddy. Yeah, they all look like they're in perfect condition. So you know you expect them to be in pretty mint condition when you're getting them straight from the Funko website. So that's three, and the fourth one. Let's make sure this one looks good. Yeah, this looks mint too. So this one is Moana with the pin. They had a a line of the, oh, right here, the line of the Disney princesses that had, like, an exclusive pin inside, so that's it in there, I don't know if you can see it behind the sticker, but there's a pin in there, so, yeah, so those were my Funko exclusives, they look good, put that aside, if I don't seem so enthusiastic about it, it's because I already knew what they were, <laughs> I ordered them, so, <laughs> this is our BAM Geek Box. This, I don't know what is in here, so I might be a little excited on this. I think the Batman was one of the themes in this geek box. I think the other themes were uh, Terminator, the Batman, Ant-Man, I think, and something else I can't remember right now. I know he was, uh, Adam from Bambox was really talking up how beautiful the signature is, um, and how it, like, takes up, like, the whole 8x10, um, so I just got, you know my investigative hat on and I was trying to determine who do I think that this signature is going to be by I looked through a lot of the themes and like nothing really made sense oh the witcher the witcher was the other theme and I, nothing really made sense I looked up some of the signatures from the cast on that I was like no, I don't think it's any of these the only thing that I came close with is in the terminator uh shit I don't remember what her name is now, but the woman who plays the Terminator in Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines, I, I looked up her signature and it was like, it, it was big, big and fancy and bubbly and everything like that. So I'm like, oh, it might be this one. Um, it would be really cool if it was Linda Hamilton too, because that's a long name, I, you know, so we'll see. Um, it's all right. I'm going to put this down here. I'll try not to look at anything. Now let's just go for it. I don't know if the pins are going to be in here. We, we were owed pins from last month, so hopefully if we do have pins, um, it'll be from last month as well. It feels like I have... It feels like a... Oh, yeah. I think there's two pins here. So let's just show one first. Geek. So what is this? This is... Oh, this looks like the... Like the Ant-Man helmet. So this is Ant-Man, I'm pretty sure. Usually it says the month on it. Because I wasn't sure if it was going to be this month or last month's, but pretty sure that that's this month. It looks like Ant-Man. And the second one is... Oh, it's another... It looks like another Ant-Man pin. So there was two. I wonder if... If everyone got two... Or if it was limited. So this is Ant-Man here. 
that's a pretty cool pin. No number on the back. No number on the back of this one either. So maybe we just got two common pins. Maybe they have two common ones this month. I like them though. They're pretty nice. I like Ant-Man. It's a good character, good movie. So I'm going to feel around in that box again because I don't know if they gave us our pins from last month. Let's see. No, I feel something. I don't think it's a pin, though. It feels like it's a... What is this, a sticker? There's a sticker here. Okay. This looks like it's a prop. It's almost like... A, it's pretty heavy. It's like a gold medallion or something like that. I'm gonna... Ooh, wow. This is actually... Pretty heavy duty. I'm um, I'm actually pretty impressed by this. I'm not usually too impressed with the uh, with the props, but this is actually pretty heavy duty here. It's like a legit necklace. Some kind of medallion. I, I mean, if I was to guess, oh, shit. If I was to guess, I would say that this is probably from The Witcher. My only guess, because I haven't seen The Witcher. I've actually never even played any of the Witcher video games. Um, so, I mean, if it's from if it's from that, I mean, there's a good possibility it's like a big part of it that you would recognize this right away. But I just don't because I've, I've never seen it. Um, I'm probably going to go and start watching it because I've heard, you know, good things about it. I just haven't had the time. Um, all right, so... Yeah, there's no other pins in here. Everything else is face down. So I'm going to guess that the next thing is going to be the art print. So what do we have left? We still have the Terminator. We did Ant-Man, the Witcher, Terminator. I don't, I don't remember. We'll, we'll see. Let's find out. Oh, yeah, the Batman. That's a little hard to see, to be honest. Um, I could tell it's like the... the face it's very dark it's almost like black and just like red like blood and you got I guess uh, it's signed by the artist down here in the corner which is nice I don't know what that signature is but we'll find out on the cheat sheet I don't know if you guys can make this out a little bit better now that it's out of the plastic 488 out of 2500 okay so that's pretty nice um it's a little difficult to make out it's pretty dark um but i mean it's a pretty nice print it's, it's easier to make out once it's out of this plastic i think because i have this ring light shining on it it's a little difficult to to make out with the glare but i like it all right so uh, last thing is the signature and it's the Terminator. Let's see if I was right. If this is going to be Terminator 3. And yeah. Looks like it. Looks like it. Yep. Oh, geez. It's Christina something or other. I can't even remember the name now. But that's a pretty nice picture. I like that. And that's a very nice signature. I gotta be honest. I, I think Adam was right on this one. That's a that's a nice, big, beautiful signature. That's very nice. And obviously, you know, it's Beckett authenticated. We got our signature, our, our uh, authentication sticker there. So let's put this aside. I'm gonna check the cheat sheet. I didn't like the cheat sheets for January. They were very just like straight to the point, no like descriptions. I feel like they used to do like some really cool like you know, paragraph about, like, you know, what you got and everything like that. And now it's kind of just... And plus, they didn't show you, like, when I got the Killer Clowns one, they didn't show you all the different possibilities of the prints that you could get. They only showed you one picture, but there was, there was multiple pictures I saw people opening online. And I was like, oh, why didn't they show you all the pictures that you could have gotten? I like seeing that. But they did it this time. Obviously, I'll, I'll, I'll put it up on the screen here. If I could get my hands right um 
So yeah, obviously we got February 2022. Autograph was Christina Loken. That was her name. Okay, prop replica is the witch necklace from The Witcher. I'm sure people know that. Um, enamel pin set. It's from Christina Cotalese. I hope I didn't butcher that, but I probably did. It's Ant-Man. So, everybody got two pins. It doesn't look like there was a limited, you know, exclusive pin. Sometimes they, I feel like most of the time they do that. I, I thought that they always did, but I guess not. Um, the art print. Ooh, I kind of like that limited one a little bit better. Um... Unless it wasn't limited, it might have just been two different art prints. But um, looking at the autograph pictures, I like the one with Arnie, the one that we got. That's pretty cool. Um, the black one, where it has her name going straight across the whole bottom, uh, just her head. I like that one. That probably would have been my second choice. Um, but they're all pretty good. They're all none of them are bad. They're all pretty similar. So there you have it. We didn't get our pins from last month. Oh, let's see. Oh, and here's our card. Featured celebrity Christina Loken, known for Terminator Three: Rise of the Machines, In the Name of the King, and Blood Rain. I'll be honest, I haven't seen her in anything besides Terminator Three, and I saw that a long time ago. Uh, those other two movies, I don't know what they are. Um, but yeah. Okay. So we didn't get our pins from last month still. Maybe they shipped them separately. I thought that they were going to put them in this box, but that's alright. Um, I would say that this was a good box. I like the pins. I like that we got two pins. A nice little bonus sticker in there. Um, I liked the art print. The, the prop is impressive, whether I knew The Witcher or not. It's a pretty nice prop. Um, so yeah, stick around, because I'm going to be unboxing the BAM Horror from this month also. This is February uh, 2022. I have it right here, so I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to do it right now. I'll stop the video and start a new one. But um, hit the like button, hit the subscribe, and the bell to get your notifications. Um... And then just check out my eBay store because all the stuff that I have on here that I'm either not interested in or that I have doubles of, I put everything on my eBay store. I'm going to leave links below for my eBay store, my Instagram, follow me on Instagram. Uh, I sent an application in for whatnot. I'm going to try and get on there. I'll let you know how that goes um, because I got a lot of Funko Pops and stuff like that that I'm going to try and sell. Um, but yeah, other than that, just stay tuned for the next video. Thanks for watching.